I'm going to make some pasta today. I'm going to use some uh, parsley and some uh, asparagus. And the pasta I'm going to use is some bow ties. And I'm going to use some parmesan and some heavy cream and some nutmeg. And here's a half a pound of um, lobster tails that I was going to use for something else. Uh, but I didn't and some garlic and I need like a fourth a cup of onion so I think I may use up some chives and half a shallot or I may use onion well my pan is on medium heat I'm going to add some olive oil maybe about three tablespoons I'm going to add the onion fourth a cup of onion I decided to go ahead and use uh, that half a shallot that I had and a little bit of green onion, the, mostly the white part. I, I'll save those chives for later. Just let this cook just a little bit. Well, the onions have cooked for about one minute. And I think I have way too much olive oil in here. And I'm going to turn down to medium low. I'm going to get some of this oil out. Because I don't want my uh, dish to be really greasy or anything. So I've got some of that out. And I'm going to add onion or garlic. Two cloves of garlic. Gently cook this garlic for about a minute until I really smell it. Well, it's gone for about a minute. I'm going to add my uh, asparagus. I chopped them up uh, fairly small, half inch to an inch size, around in there. I'm going to saute these up. Well, the asparagus have been going five minutes in this low heat, medium low heat. I'm going to add the uh, half a pound of lobster tail that I chopped up. I just want to sort of warm this up for a minute. Well, the lobster has gone a couple minutes. It's like halfway done. It was raw, of course, when I, it was raw when I put it in there. Add just a little more salt, just a pinch to season the lobster. Some pepper. Not too much. We add the heavy cream. It's a half a cup of heavy cream. A little bit of nutmeg. Just a fourth of a teaspoon. And we'll let this come up to a bubble over medium heat now. We need to turn it up to medium. Well, the cream has bubbled for about three minutes, maybe four. I'm going to add just a little bit of pasta sauce or pasta water to it. I'm going to add the pasta. It's been sitting around because I cooked this first. Get that in there. But the pasta will warm up just fine in the sauce. I cooked half the package about three cups of it dry three cups and we're going to toss this around in here and loosen up the uh, pasta separate it well i toss this pasta the pasta around to separate it and get it coated with the sauce and it absorbed the sauce and i did add just a little bit more of the pasta water i'm going to add just a little bit of parsley A little bit of Parmesan. Maybe a little more Parmesan. About a fourth of a cup. And just give it a final stir and we're ready to plate. Let's plate some up. I've already given it a preliminary taste and it's very good. Very nice. Very good. 
you have to make this. How could I resist not tasting it beforehand? I'm going to put just a little additional Parmesan cheese on top. If you have some extra special olive oil, that would be nice too. A little bit of parsley. And some lemon wedges to squeeze. And if you like red chili flakes, just a little bit of that. A little bit more. Mm. I hope you try it. Mm. Very nice and delicious. You can get a piece of lobster though. There I go. Thanks so much for watching. Mm. Have a great day. Bye bye.